everyone and welcome to XR Corporation. I'm John Kronk, Applications Director for the Power Management Group, and today I would like to present you to our latest flash LED driver designed for use with low profile supercapacitor technology. With a drive of up to 4.3 amps, resulting in over 400 lux, this device, the XRP6840, is today's most powerful flash LED driver on the market. Today's digital cameras are constantly increasing in resolution, easily reaching 12 megapixels, and rapidly spreading into various segments of portable electronics, such as cell phones, PDAs, and of course, digital cameras. While producing great results in broad daylight, low light or nighttime operations require an ever more powerful flash to guarantee a good signal to noise ratio, meaning a good quality picture. LED-based flashes are particularly suited for portable equipment as they are small in size, low voltage and low profile, and provide added flexibility such as torch modes. However, most portable batteries would need to significantly increase in size to support the 14 watt instantaneous power required by such a flash. Recent technology development in small form factor supercapacitors combined with the XRP6840 provides a technical and mechanical solution to support a usable high power flash function in a portable device. In this architecture, the supercapacitor is used to store and provide the instantaneous power to the LED flash while being charged at a low constant current from the equipment battery. The XRP6840 provides all the features and flexibility needed to implement an easy supercapacitor based flash LED solution. Those include torch or flash mode operation, where the flash is current programmable up to 4.3 amps and the torch's current is programmable up to 300 milliamps. Battery load li is limited to 600 milliamps. There's two or three channel operation options, operation from a standard lithium ion battery and requires only four external components to operate. Now, the programming is done via a simple standard I squared C interface and TTL IOs are available for tight control by the camera module. Let's watch a demo now. This is the XRP6840 evaluation board. It's configured with three channel version of the XRP6840. It is a small 4x4 millimeter QFN right here. The supercapacitor is right above. This is a supercapacitor of 0.6 farads provided by TDK. Others include CapEx and AVX. On the right, we can see three LEDs, which are Rebel PWF4 flash. There's also a flash push button and a flash ready indicator, as well as the I squared C interface. This board is programmed to output a total of 4.3 amps, its maximum, over 400 lux. You may want to put on your sunglasses for this one. As you can see, that was pretty bright. Also, the flash indicator is already on, meaning the, the board is ready for another flash. Even though we've just output over 4 amps of current, the battery's only seen a 600 milliamp load. Now let's press it again and hold it down, and you'll see the flash turns off automatically. There's a 110 millisecond timeout in this case, turns off the output to protect the battery and also protect the device from overheating. Now let me show you the torch mode. In the background, the XRP6840 is being put through its paces, driving at various load currents and switching LED configurations through the I2C port. A unique feature of the XRP6840 is its ability to return the energy stored in the supercapacitor back to the main system. This feature is useful if a low battery level is detected and extra energy is required to properly shut down the system or for surge power requirements. Samples and volume production are currently available for the XRP6840 as well as this evaluation board and all technical documentation. Please contact your XR sales representative or visit us online at www.xr.com. This is all I have for today. Thank you for watching this brief video and remember to visit xr.com for more exciting products from XR.